first night was extremely cold. It got down to uh, minus 29 with the wind chill, and we didn't get any sleep. We were in good spirits. We have lots of good company. People are checking in on us. It's nothing. Uh, it's not nearly as bad as real homelessness would be, but we are definitely uh, coming to understand to, to what it's like, and we're able to convey that message, spread awareness um, as to the severity and realness of the problem of youth homelessness in Winnipeg. And uh, we're, we've collected lots of donations to go to Ray, which is the goal. So overall, we're doing well. We've been eating well, um, which is which is very nice. Uh, we all know that real homelessness is, is not like that. People are not as, as kind to, to bring you food. They don't know you're there. Uh, so we're, we're lucky in that regard. I'm expecting a little more awareness kind of to buzz around campus. We've got a lot more donations coming in. And hopefully by the end of it, we've had enough conversations and people are talking about it that they understand that the youth in Winnipeg are, who are living on the streets are not there because it is their choice. And without support from somebody else, they aren't able to get off of the streets and, and live uh, a more stable and safe lifestyle because all they can really focus on when they're living outside is survival. So that's, that's the goal, and I, I'm expecting that to increase a little bit maybe slow down right at the end, but that's, uh, it's looking good.